everybody and welcome to my February kit lineup. This is so exciting. I am very hyped. February is going to be a good month. If you guys, if this is your first video, here's my little rundown. I use two planners. One is my one that I film plan with me in and one of them is my off-camera planner that I just do for fun daily so that I can still have planning as just a hobby and not have it be like work. So, if you want to see the spreads that are in my planner, like everyday planner, my non-filming planner, make sure you follow me on Instagram or you'll have to wait until the complete end of the year to see them. So, with that being said, we're going to just jump right into it. The first week is January 30th through February 5th. And this is the week that Andrea and I are going to be watching The Notebook for our girls night. And I've never seen The Notebook, which she says is a disgrace. So... Here we are. So she got this, made, had this custom art done, and I am an SPC affiliate. Use Hannah 10 to save 10% off. Um, also, fun fact, my entire life I've been told that I look just like Rachel McAdams. So if you know what I look like, let me know if you agree. But I could not tell you what any of this stuff is in this kit because I have not watched the movie. So we'll find out when we find out it'll be wednesday of the week that this is put down before i am familiar with what i am using but that's fine the kit is cute nonetheless and i did use the build your own bundle for all of these i've been loving doing that and i'll let you guys know what you would put in the notes if you wanted the exact same thing so this is what I did. This is the front page. I chose these sparkle headers. This page is standard. This page is standard. I chose the love washi. So if you guys tell me to change the washi, whichever, if it's like the pattern, I'll switch out the pattern from like the standard, which is sparkle. Or if it's like a straight line of things, I'll switch out the bow and leave the sparkle. But I'm just using also plain silver. And then I'm using hey boo for the underlays because I thought hearts were cutie. So that's what I am using with the notebook kit. I think that it'll, I had a hard time picking foil. I felt like nothing looked good, like no fun foil. So I just went with that. The next week is the 6th through the 12th. And I have no reason for using this other than I wanted to. Pastels felt kind of february e. And so we're doing it. I'm using the Candyland kit from SPC. This has been in my collection for so long and her time is now. Love it. Obsessed with it. Get that adorable tall girl. I just love the pastel colors. It's so cute and fun. Ugh, the little sprinkle pattern. So cute. Got the other skin tones there. And then we have some extra boxes here. And I do have the foil bundle that came with this, which is in Lavender Hollow, which is absolutely stunning. We've got the candy overlays and headers. Two sheets of those, obviously. Two sheets of the bougie and the bottom washi. And then um, I already put, I don't have the scripts with this because I think I already had put them, used them, I needed them for something. So they're not in here, but that's fine. And then I'm also using the lollipop underlays from my shop in Purple Hollow to add to the little Candyland vibes. I'm very excited about that spread. The next week is Valentine's Day, which is the 13th through the 19th. Again, all of the kits that I'm using are from SPC, let's be real. And it is the Pillow Talk kit. I thought this was like a, a sexy, cute valentine's kit i love valentine's day it is my third favorite holiday my birthday then christmas then valentine's day because i just love love Ugh, it's just so cute and pretty and i'm obsessed that's so cute um i think that there's some extras extra boxes here they are with like the lingerie or like the boxers so cute so i did the build room bundle and i'm using purple tie-dye it looks so good um, I chose the Shine 2 headers, standard. I chose the XOXO washi, standard. And then I chose the rosette underlays. Oh, this is just going to look literally, I'm so excited to see this laid down. It's going to look just, oh, so good. So that's what I'm doing for the Pillow Talk kit. Obsessed. And purple tie-dye is just so good with this. The next week is my mom's birthday week. My mom um, has 
passed away. She died in 2016. But I still like to do something for her birthday. And so I'm using the Let's Go Party Kit. Which is... This is the reformatted version if it ever focuses. There we go. And I used it the first time. And I'm using it again. For my mom's birthday. And I'm very excited. Here are the full boxes. My mom was very like glitzy, glamorous, loved Barbie. So this is very her and her favorite color was black. So the fact that there's black in this, I'm obsessed. There's that. And then I am doing another build your own bundle. This is mainly in black. I did do one sheet in deep pink. If you guys ever want like just one sheet of the underlays in a different color, put it in the personalization. No problem makes no additional work for me so i used the shine two headers again this is standard i chose the queen washi standard and then i just did the shine underlays and i did one page in black and one page in deep pink i wanted to keep it mainly black because that was my most favorite color and like also my favorite color but i wanted a little bit of the pink in there so i just did the one sheet of underlays and i'm so excited to see that laid down. That's going to be so fun. And then the next week is like the one going into March, but I already knew what I was using. So I just pulled it the 27th through March 5th. And this is the week that Andrea and I are going to be in Disney. Going on vacay. So I have this Disney kit, which is Magical Bound or Magic Bound. I think we were both using this because we're doing Disney Bounds. It's just going to be a blast. I love the little Cindy and the Tiana. We've got the Tall Castle, which I'll absolutely be using. Um, yeah. We have the little Cindy fountain. So cute. And then, again, I did a build your own bundle, and I added on two additional sheets of underlays because there's going to be probably a lot of extenders. I'm using Pink Hollow. So I chose the Mickey Headers standard. I chose the Lux Disney because... I'm, if I'm going with Andrea, we got to do the Lux. That's her energy. Her vibes is fancy. And then I have four sheets of Lux Magic in Pink Hollow. Do I know that I'm going to need all of them? No, but I figured I'd rather have too many than not enough. And yeah, so that's what I'm going to be using with that. I could have done gone with silver, but I was already using silver in February, so I just didn't want to use it again. Now we're moving on to my filming planner. So you guys will see plan with me is with all of these um, things. First thing I'm going to use is Frosty. This is so pretty. Cute little winter art. This came out kind of late for winter art in my opinion. There's the blondies. So I had already done my January lineup. But I had room in February for it. And so we are using it. I'm using just silver foil. That's another thing. I was using silver in both planners. So I was like, I don't need any more silver. So I chose the Snow 3 headers, I believe. That's one of the things I can't keep straight is which snows are which. But I'm pretty sure this is Snow 3. And the Jack Frost underlays. Because that's my favorite out of all of the different snowflake patterns in my shop. Is Jack Frost. Um, I was going back and forth on what color to use with this guy. I almost did light pink. But then I just thought, you know... We'll just do a classic silver. Super pretty. The so next week, I am using Planner Heaven. This kit's very pink, so I thought it worked. I'm doing actually a lot of pink kits in this planner. Um, yeah, I'm not using these underlays. I don't really know why they're in here. I guess you could use the unicorn pattern. It does match because there's pink and purple in here, but I went with gold. So, I don't know why those are in there. Oh, I love this kit because that's me right there playing Hannah but yeah I'm using this kit I think it is so cute and pretty and like the colors are very February we love it got the blondie gals there but there's gold accents in this kit so that was what made me decide to go gold I was originally also going to do pink but I was like oh it's kind of a lot of pink so I went with pixie gold I think it's so pretty. I'm doing the sparkle headers. Standard page. I'm just doing the, like, what came in the kit. Like, what naturally comes with it for that. Standard. And then I'm doing the two sparkle underlays. All in pixie gold, which is my favorite foil. 
Pixie Gold is my number one favorite of all foils. Well, like, look at that. That's just so good. I'm obsessed. The next week is Valentine's week. So I am using this Romeo and Juliet. It's called Starcrossed Bundle from SPC. I've also never seen this movie, so LOL. Got the boxes here. Got the blonde ones for the add-on. I won't be using this box because A, I hate that the colors don't match at all, and I've never seen that movie, but here she is. I'm just keeping it in there so, like, it can be remembered that that's what went with it and came with it. But those will definitely be destashed. I love that scene, or that sheet. I'm doing matte gold with this. The sparkle headers. Um, I did the rose one washi. And I did rosette with this as well. All in matte gold. There's some gold accents throughout the kit. So gold was the choice. But the kit's very muted. So I thought that the matte would be quite pretty. And I am very, really excited about that combo. The next week is my mom's birthday week. So another thing about my mom is that Christmas was her jam. So Andrea kind of sparked this idea for me. Because I did not get this kit to begin with. I'm not obsessed with it. But it's a hot pink Christmas kit. And so for it to be in February, the hot pink really works and it's Christmas because my mom loves Christmas. So I just think it couldn't have been a better, couldn't not have been a better choice. The foil I chose for this was Heart Hollow because Valentine's Day is full, or February is full of love. Love my mom, love the month, love, love. So there's the kit and I'm doing the sparkle headers. Those are like my favorite, just general headers. Standard, standard. I chose the like confetti birthday. Um, you can really see it in there. Washi. And then I'm doing the checker underlays because there's quite a bit of like checker print throughout the kit. So, and checker looks really good in Heart Hollow. You can really see the hearts, and I think the hearts are really good for any like lovey kit, obviously, or any like groovy retro kit. I just feel like it's the vibes. And there we go. I did not want to use pink because I thought that would be a bit hurting. It would hurt my eyes. So then lastly, my Disney week, I am using the Magical Land kit, even though I'm going to Disney World, but I have no plans to really ever go to Disneyland because, listen, Disney World's bigger, and I've just heard anybody I know who's been to Disneyland has said it's not as good as Disney World. So I'm sorry if that offends you. I feel like a lot of it depends on which park you grew up going to. And I grew up with Disney World because I was an East Coaster my whole life. But I'm just using it because it's Disney vibes, okay? That's what we're going with. And this kit's really old, obviously, because the washi strip came separately. So we just need to move her out of the collection. And I'm using um, the exact same bundle as the last Disney kit, only I'm using Purple Hollow instead of Pink Hollow. So I'm not even going to go through all of the things. I'm just going to fan her out for you to see. And that is it, guys. That is my whole February kit lineup. If you happen to be using any of these kits, I mean, there are the two actual Valentine's Day ones. But if you happen to be using any of these other ones, let me know. And that being said, if you guys liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you did not, then well, give it a thumbs down. Either way, you're helping out my channel. Comment down below, subscribe if you have not already, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.